Hello, welcome to Maths with Jay. So here we're going to be looking at how to find the power of a matrix. Last time we input a matrix and found its inverse. So let's just get that matrix back again. Just a reminder that we use the mode button to uh, get into matrix mode to start with and use mode six. Right, so let's just get our matrix back again. So we need to do shift four and we put it, input it as matrix A. So let's just look at it. You wouldn't normally need to do that, but just to show you um, what it is. So you will have input your matrix. So what we want to do now is bring that matrix back again. So if we want to square it, we simply use the X squared button. So this is going to square matrix A. And if you want to cube it, same sort of thing. So we uh, clear that. Shift, matrix, matrix A. And then to cube, we use the um, shift to get the X cubed, which is actually A cubed, obviously, in this case. And that cubes our matrix. Notice that it always highlights one of the elements of the matrix, and that's the one that's shown in the bottom right-hand corner. That's, that's useful if you've got decimal values and um, you want to see what the exact values are. That will be given in the bottom right-hand corner. Now, something to note is that you can't use the x to the power of anything key, so that when you've got a matrix, you can only raise it to the power of 2 or 3 using the button that I've shown you already. So this will work for, uh, for any square matrix, so you could use a 2x2 two two matrix as well. 